Welcome to Guitar Gallery. It's Stefan and Stefan. Yeah. And today we've got something new. Uh, it's actually a new brand, Stefan. Yeah, oh, this is exciting. And, uh, you know, we, we never want to be known as gear snobs. Uh, we've got <laughs> some amazing guitars, but we want to be known as quality snobs. <laughs> yeah. And so as our business continues to expand, we realize that there's definitely a customer base that we can assist with a quality solution. And that's uh, where Yamaha actually fits yeah. into the picture. Yamaha and quality has gone hand in hand since forever. Eh? It's a wonderful brand. It's a huge brand. And what, mm. you know, it's one of those power brands. Whatever they make, mm. you just get a certain guarantee of quality. Yeah. And that's, I'm super power excited. Boats. I think they do power boats as well. Yes, everything is power. <laughs> so this specific model that we've got here is the um, Yamaha A5R for Rosewood. Mm. Um, Stefan, it's got the ARE top which is like a torrified mm. um, they take on torrification or yes. their me method yeah. in, in, in aging the top yeah. um, and that really the, the tonal benefits are real um, the, we are way beyond the point where it's speculation it's a fact now that you do get a more open more played in more resonant sound when you um, essentially cook the top uh, for any of you who don't know it's essentially scientific uh, Term there. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> um, when you when you they they literally cook the the top at a low temperature in an oxygen free environment, and that just get rid of gets rid of some of the mass of the top. It makes it lighter and more resonant. Not lighter in color though, lighter in weight. Yeah. Definitely gives it this caramel brown color, yeah. and you can hear it in the sound. It's absolutely it's wonderful. It's something um, it's something that has recently taken the markets mm. by storm, and it really works. So mm. it's a really cool feature on this guitar. So if we go through this, this for me, as you know, is the is the wood combination that I prefer. Sitka spruce top, uh, beautiful East Indian rosewood. This guitar is is made in Japan, so so this is this is a top of the range again, quality, quality quality guitar. Yeah. Um, and what I like as well, because we compare it to some other guitars that we've got in the store, it's always good to have a reference point. You know, how does it compare to a traditional American? Uh, guitar has compared to a more modern mm. uh, European guitar, yeah, for example. Yeah. Um, and uh, what, what was actually stood out for me on this specific guitar was a beautiful bass sound mm. and airiness in the sound. Yes, yes. Almost like sitting back a little bit, yeah. and it's you can dig in yeah. and just stays. Yeah. sweet and yeah. soft on the ear that, that's know, kind of what i experienced with this guitar also this guitar is scalloped bracing on the on the inside which makes it even more resonant and more light and mm. more um, that definitely contributes towards that airiness i yes, found yes like. for sure and you know you spoke about the if you if you well at least my opinion i haven't asked you for yours but i think this guitar tends to be more of a vintage sounding guitar mm. than a contemporary sound guitar yeah. but I don't, there's no lack in the mid-range it's yeah. not it's not a it's, it hasn't got a bad mid-range scoop it's full there's nothing lacking for me we mm. find you know it's the first time obviously that i've played it now and it's fun it's it's a full warm pleasant sound what more mm. do you want what yeah. more do you want it's great work the, the quality and you mentioned uh the, the string angles you know open. that's what we that's the first thing we look at but yeah. even before we look at the guitar yes. we literally go there and look at the neck angle and string yes. break and on point on point uh we've got we've got another yamaha in stock as well which we're going to do a review on yeah. and also the same thing the neck angle mm. is perfect the brake angle over the saddle is perfect mm. what more do you want it sounds great hopefully you can hear over the clips that we played yeah. um and it sounds great acoustically as well you know these guitars have great pickups uh, electronic systems in well let's maybe go there stefan so so volume on top which uh yeah, everyone kind of should know yeah. treble pretty pretty standard bass there's additional feature to the bass yeah. button yeah if you, well if you hold in the bass button um there's an automatic feedback reduction functionality that kicks in yeah. that looks for frequencies which is typically the bass frequencies which is yeah. why, well, probably why they put it on the bass button uh which just looks for frequencies that want to get out of control and just reduces them mm. into into uh, context with the rest and then this is a dual source pickup where there's a under saddle yeah. as well as a um, they've modeled microphones yes. uh, which is in the preamp and you can blink between yeah. the two yeah so essentially the blink button on the one side you've got 
a choice of either one of two uh, microphone sounds that are available through the preamp. It's not a physical microphone within the guitar, uh, but the idea is there to capture the warmth of a vintage, you know, uh, or not a vintage, but a studio recorded guitar, typically with a vintage mic, because mm. that's, that's just the holy grail of it all. So you've got two different mic sounds, and you can blend any of those mic sounds mm. with the undersaddle pickup. So this guitar, you know, it's as versatile as it is in its sound. It, you, can, you can go to the stage right now, you've got, uh, you know, the versatility of the pickup, just I want to say you can use it in studio and you can use it on stage. You can use it in any studio and you can use it on any stage because the, it just functions. Acoustically, the guitar is versatile and electronically, it's super versatile. So, you know, this is just a go-to canon. It's absolutely a wonderful. Mm. And um, understanding correctly, this is this is one of Yamaha's uh, premium models yeah. and it sounds that way. It's mm. great. I've got a Yamaha guitar, which is not nearly the price of this one. I don't think it's even... Everyone's got a this. Yamaha guitar. Thank you. And it's still one of Except my go-to guitars. The <laughs> Get with the program, I couldn't, bro. I couldn't afford a Yamaha when I was young. <laughs> no, this is absolutely wonderful. And it's a privilege to have these premium Yamahas in stock for the first time because at Guitar Gallery, uh, we keep ourselves busy with premium sounds and premium guitars. Mm. And this is no exception to the rule. So if you're looking for a quality guitar solution with uh, all solid... Uh, woods in terms of the top and, and back and sides um, and looking for a great pickup and uh, well I don't think you have to look much further than this performance guitar. guitar for sure so thank you for watching uh, we really do appreciate it and uh, please continue to follow us and, and see what uh, else we're gonna have in store in the near future bye bye